All questions appearing in this test are 100% fictional. Any resemblance to real persons or entities living or dead is purely coincidental. No professionals were forced or harmed to create this practice test. In the latest video that I posted on this Wednesday, I talked about the five important topics that you need to master in order to crack the Salesforce Platform Developer 1 exam. If you haven't yet checked that video, then there's a link over here and also down in the description. Just hit that link, go check that out right now. And after creating that video, I thought that why not create a practice test and share it with you guys so that you can actually get the feel of giving the certification exam in real. And not only that, uh, to also understand the format of the question that will be asked in the certification exam. I would highly, highly recommend you guys to give this practice test before going for your Platform Developer 1 certification exam uh, because it will help you avoid the fear which you might get while reaching to your examination center or while clicking on that launch button if you're planning to give the certification exam from your home. Also, if you're not prepared for the exam and you're just trying your hands onto this practice test, I would highly, highly recommend you preparing for the exam first and then only giving the uh, practice test, right? Uh, because if you'll be just giving it right away without actually preparing for it, you might never actually want to give a certification exam at all. Now, what are you guys waiting for? Just hit the link down in the description that will take you to the practice test uh, which will help you prepare for your Salesforce Platform Developer 1 certification exam. And also, if uh, after giving this practice test, you score 70% uh, or 75%, then you can consider yourself to be eligible to give this the Salesforce Platform Developer 1 exam. Of course, it's not a benchmark that you have to cross in order to give the certification exam, but that's some, that's that's just a percentage that I'm trying to tell you that you need to prepare yourself for uh, so that you can be better uh, in the examination or, or in the real examination. A note. The questions included in this practice test are for general information and you are advised to not depend solely on these questions to crack the certification exam. Another note about dumps. So if you're just planning to give the certification exam solely based on through the dumps or to the, uh, or to the practice questions that you get from somewhere in the market or from your colleague or from some of your friend or your cousin, uh, I would highly recommend you not doing so because you might get that certification that will give you that uh, boost or that give you that confidence uh, that you have been looking for in order to apply for a job or in order to get a new job if you're already in uh, a, like if you're already working as a Salesforce developer somewhere or as a, as a Salesforce administrator but it will not actually help you in a longer run why because at the end of the day your capability and your skill sets matter and if you're not hands-on with the Salesforce development and you are getting this certification i don't think this certification will add any value into your career and in fact uh, it will be a negative point if you'll be trying to give an interview give an interview for a new job or uh, yeah for, for your new job or for your first job also in the last practice test video that i created for salesforce administrator certification i specifically mentioned that irrespective of whenever you're watching this video if you see anybody selling any dumps or any practice test that will uh, guarantee you to crack the crack any certification exam of Salesforce, then please mark that as spam or phishing or whatever uh, options, like an inappropriate or whatever options YouTube gives you. Uh, why? Because I am highly against of using dumps to crack a Salesforce certification exam because it reduces uh, the reliability or the value of having a Salesforce certification, which we as uh, like as humans or as people in the Salesforce community really does not want. Also, if you think that this practice test will actually help you crack that Salesforce certification exam, specifically the Platform Developer 1 exam, then don't forget to hit the thumbs up as well as the subscribe button over here with the notification bell icon so you'll be the first one to get notified whenever we post a new video onto the channel of Salesforce Health with the host, Suresh Sharma. See you in the next video. Till then, bye-bye. Take care.